things first to appreciate your support i am back so uh, we look at the microwave that is running this is rotating but it's not heating water so ensure that it's empty and this plate is well placed this is the power cable put some water on a plastic plate That is one minute, and then uh, we start. So it's rotating. Let's see if the water will come out hot. still cold so we move the plate power it off so to, to remove this panel we will turn it around please guys read this eh? Warning, microwave energy, do not remove this cover. Do not operate this oven if the door is bent, warped, or otherwise damaged and does not close firmly. Do not tamper with the door safety interlocks. Maintenance should be carried out only by qualified servicemen. Remove plug and disconnect from the mains before removing the cover. Please do not open a microwave if you have no experience with this. This can kill you. It stores a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of power. So we're going to remove this, this. We have this two here, two here, and we have one the other side. Quite dirty. So before touching anything here, we need to discharge power from this uh, capacitor here. How to use appliers because it's insulated. Actively, we'll use this to discharge. Once that is done, so we, we check the fuse. This is the fuse. Because if the fuse is faulty, that transmits power from this to the motor transformer, then the, it won't heat. So if this is okay, if the fuse is okay, we have to check the diode. This is the diode. If the diode is okay, then you have to replace the magnetron. This is the magnetron. So we start with the fuse. So we're going to use a multimeter. There is no fuse. Fuse is blown. So you're going to replace the fuse. So this is the fuse and this is the diode. So we're going to replace the fuse.
so still not working so we'll also change the diode this is the diode same procedure power it off then discharge the capacitor 